everybody and welcome back. This is Bonnie again and I'm going to finish up the punch book. So um, in this one I am going to be doing a owl, which is really cute on cards for graduation or anybody I guess if you just want to say I am hooting you a hello or whatever. So for this punch um, all you need is two scalp circle punches in a dark brown and two scalp in like a tannish color. You need the trio flower punch. You need two of them in orange. The small little tiny heart. And then you need three of the half inch punch, one in brown and two in the white. And then you need two quarter inch punches for the owl's eyes. So let's get started. So the first thing I went ahead and did is I took one of the brown punches and I just cut it right in half so that I have two pieces. And then I'm going to get all the parts together. And then I'm just going to cut off on the scalp trio punch. All I did was cut off two of these, cut the two little loops off from it. And I want this piece here, the one with three loops on it is what I want. So you're going to do that with both of the scalp circle punches. Just get rid of them. And then on the circle, on the heart, we're going to cut this part right off from it. And we are going to keep this little tiny nose. I'm just trimming it up a little. It didn't cut very good. We're going to keep this part, not this little part of the heart. We want to keep the tinier piece. So we're going to keep that. And then we're going to take the half inch circle dark one and we're going to cut that one right in half. So there. So now we have all our parts that we need ready. And then I'm going to take the so suede or soft suede stamp pad from Stampin' Up and a sponge. And I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to sponge just the bottom edge of the um, of the light brown on the scalp circle. I'm going to try not to talk too much during my videos, if at all possible, because I love to talk. But I've got a really bad cold. So once you have that, we're just going to stack these two together. Not completely on top of each other, just kind of like, um, kind of like that. So it looks like that. Then we're going to take one of the halves. And these are representing the owl's wings. Oh, I probably should have chalked that first, and I forgot. So I would chalk them up if, but since I already put the glue and stuff on, I'll have to chalk them up later once it dries on a little bit more. But you'd want to chop the feet up a little bit before you. Um, and we'll set that part aside because that's the body. And we're going to do the eyes. Should use all the tools, might even have a problem here. Putty on my eye. Oh, I'll have to wait until it dries. 
We'll take an eraser to it. Huh? All right. You want these eyes kind of touching. Eyelashes. Difficulties today. He's super cute. I just love him. Well, there he is, everybody. That's the owl that goes in my punch book. Well, thanks a lot. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.